Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. These are not an Eid Takbirat or calling for prayers. It's Palestinian celebration for their victory. It's their entry into Bab al Rahma, the gate of mercy area of Al Aqsa Mosque compound in Jerusalem, the old city, for the first time since 2003. 16 years of its closure under the claim of a court order, Israeli banned Muslims worship in the area as they want to build their temple inside Al Aqsa. In an effort to put an end to Palestinian defiance of the Israeli order against Babi Rahma, Israeli police detained in recent days over 100 Palestinian activists and religious figures in Jerusalem, while Palestinians insist to pray there and to keep it opened. Israeli failed to stop the crown from reopening the restricted gate. Palestinians by themselves achieve a new heroic, peaceful victory in time of the Arab leaders and Muslim silence around the world. As Al Aqsa represents the world's third holiest site for Muslims, and they should defend. By this victory, Palestinians send a strong message to the world that all the previous call for the international support to save its land from Israeli forces were nonsense, including the last conference, Warsaw, that held in February in Poland, led by the United States of America. Palestinians will get back their lands by their hands and sacrifice, not by their calls to the Arabs and other leaders around the world. Halal Gaza, Women for Palestine. Let's <laughs> go!